What's up, world? Juvenile Styles coming at you with number seven, eight, and nine strains of the 12 strains of Christmas. So we got Mango Kush, Sour Diesel, and Pink Candy. Hey you, welcome to my Kush review at Juvenile Styles. This is what I do. I smoke Kush, Hash, and Shatter too. Go and check them out. I try them out for you. By the time I'm done, we'll be on the moon. Now let's start the show. Thank you for the view. So I think we'll start off by lighting up the pink candy. And then we'll go to the mango kush and end it off with the sour D. So let's light up the pink candy. Give it a nice review and then jump on to the next. So let's light this up and see how it is and then go to the other ones. So this actually has a really nice kind of like a candy taste to it. So it's like, hmm, it does have a really nice sweet taste to it. I kind of like taste kind of one of those like, you know, like the bow tie candies or whatever. I kind of taste that a little bit, kind of like a minty like candy taste. It tastes really nice. So let's take a nice look at this bud. So this pretty much was all one big bud. This is two grams minus the joint that I rolled up of it so here I'll hold it so you can see it a little better there you go look at the nice crystal on that it's almost it has a nice like kind of purple tint to it really nice looking bud so there's pretty much all one bud that tastes really good so it has a really nice sweet kind of candy smell to it too it actually smells really delicious so that's a really nice looking bud. Why don't we break it in half and take a nice look in the middle of it. There we go. Oh, that looks very nice and a lot of crystal. It's a nice hard bud too. A little sticky, but it's very nice. And I'm pretty sure that this one was 28% THC. And... The mango kush, I'm pretty sure, was 26. And the sour diesel was about 21. So, this is a really nice looking strain. That's all, except for this joint. That's 2 grams of it. Nice fat 2 grams. So, I'll give the rating for the flavor a nice... I'll give it a nice five, at least five. I mean, at least a four, four out of five. At least it's a very nice taste and strain. So count. That's a fat two grams as well. This one, the purple candy, came from Miku Siku. The uh, <coughs> sour diesel was from Smoke Arrest, and this was from a good friend of mine. So the mango Kush. So. <coughs> They're all really good. I can tell by looking at them. I haven't had them yet, as you can tell. So, they are looking really good, though. So, the Mango Kush especially looks really good. So, I'll give an overall rating, I'd say, of at least four, four out of five to the Pink Candy. It's a very delicious taste. I definitely recommend it. Let me know if you tried it in the, in the comment section. And... I want to let you guys know sorry things are a little different for Christmas. I tried to do this little, I guess, Christmas special type of thing. So I hope you all are liking it. I hope you all having a good Christmas. Things will be going back to normal right after Christmas. And I'm going to start taking a bong hit of each strain too instead of just smoking a joint. I'm going to do both. We'll smoke. We'll either take a bong hit and then smoke a joint or vice versa. I think it's a good idea. I talked to a few of you guys on my live about it. It was it seemed like a really good idea, so I'm going to do it. So, like I said, I'll give an overall rating of at least 4 out of 5 to the uh, Purple Candy. It's a very nice strain. I definitely recommend it. Um, so, if you get a chance, I definitely say try it out. But, as for that, I think maybe we should jump onto the mango cushion and see how it tastes so i'm going to nub this out 
and we'll try the mango out. So yeah, this one's the mango. Let's light it up. Ooh, that has a little bit of a stronger flavor, like a stronger hit to it. And actually, it's a nice taste, though. It's a. I kind of taste a bit of mango, like kind of a citrus like taste. Yeah, kind of mangoey. And. It seems like it got a nice hit. Like you feel it in the back of your throat. It feels nice, though. Tastes nice. So nice, warm feeling in the back of my throat, tasting that. So this is five grams of the mango kush. That seems like a really nice account, especially for 5G. So let's take a nice butt out and take a nice look at it. This here seems to be a nice fat butt. As you can see, it is a very nice looking butt as well. This is a nice hard butt too. It seems to be a little less sticky as the um, purple candy was, but the bud's just, a, just as hard. So, if you compare them, the, uh, what about that one? Is that it here? Yeah, if you compare them, the, uh, I don't know, that's not it. That's one that's going to be coming up next, though. Orange cream, make sure you stay for that and orange cookies those are both coming up soon so make sure you stay for that but the purple candy i put it right here so if you compare them they're both look pretty close to the same color this one might be a little darker but they're both very nice looking strains so let's take a look in the middle of this bud As you can see, it looks really nice too. It seems to be a little lighter than the uh, purple candy in the middle of it, but they both look like very good strains. So now let's give the mango kush a smell test. Oh yeah, that definitely tastes. Um, definitely, definitely taste. Why do I always mix? mix uh, <laughs> why do I always mix those up? It smells very good though has a nice mango smell to it so like I said that's a nice fat five grams it might be a little extra because like I said a friend of mine had given it to me but it does look like a nice fat five maybe six but he said that it was five so it looks very nice so I definitely give it a nice taste rating it has a bit of a stronger flavor than the purple candy did but the purple candy um, lived up pretty good to its name. The purple candy actually kind of had a bit of a candy taste to it. But the mango does too. So I mean they're both pretty much live up to their expectations for flavor. They both taste very delicious. So I'll give an overall rating. I'll give the mango kush at least a 4 out of 5 as well maybe 4.5 out of 5 it's a very delicious strain so I definitely recommend it if you get a chance to try it out I think we should jump on to the sour diesel so let's light up the sour diesel joint things are just a little different right now because uh, Christmas and family, you know, things are a little hectic. So you know how it is. Things are crazy. That's why I appreciate all of you when you stop by and spend time at, with me at Juvenile Styles. Because I know how busy it can be. So, let's light up the Sour D. Let me know in the comments if you like some of the songs that I posted up in the last little while. Because... If you do, I'll post some more. I had some fun doing those. I mean, the DMCA one wasn't as good as uh, the thank you one. I just kind of wrote that quick because I wanted it to be out there and fucking soon as it was started, like, picking up. So, I could have spent a little bit more time on it, but I didn't want to waste too much time on it, neither. I just wanted to 
kind of like make my point so I didn't know what else to do so I just wrote that little diss track so the sour D it actually has a lot it lives up to its name in the sour I definitely taste the sour to it and I kind of like do kind of taste a bit of like like the gas taste you know what I mean like the diesel taste taste very nice though I like that it's a nice switch up I like switching the taste up of my weed so let's take a nice look at this bud but wow well, so you can't really see it good through the bag so let's pull it out oh shoot I'm throwing the bag at myself so here we go let's do the bud broke in half as I was pulling it out but it does look very nice so this seems to be a lot lighter color of a green this is almost like a lime tint green like a neon green looks very nice so let's snip it it has a really like kind of like a creamy smell to it actually but it has a nice sour smell too but it is like a nice cream it smell like a nice creamy smell to it actually smells really nice I kind of taste it and the flavor a little bit too but I find the sourness kind of overtakes the like kind of cream taste you know so yeah that's the but it kind of broke open as I was pulling it out so that's the middle of that one so they're all very good strains I wouldn't really I don't know they all have their uh, good couple good qualities about them I'd say they're all kind of similar in look I mean you could definitely tell the difference between them but they are all very good strains if I was gonna pick one of my a favorite out of the three I would probably say I don't know it's a good competition I don't know I'd probably pick I think the mango Kush had a little bit more THC I'm not sure I think the purple cushion the man or pur purple candy and the mango were close to THC so I would pick one of those two just because they're a little higher but they're all really good strains so I'll give an overall rating of an even four to the sour diesel and a four point um, did I give a four out of, I gave a four out of five I think to those so I'll give a three point five out of five to the sour diesel just a little half a point off that's all they're all really close so with that I hope you all are having a good Christmas I'm gonna try my best to get the last three up by Christmas tomorrow it'll be up oh, and by tomorrow night sometime hopefully so it's just been really crazy I want to have them out as soon as possible I hope y'all being patient and I thank you all for being patient so with that I hope you all are having a good Christmas like I said thank you all for spending time with me on the holidays a ho 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 and a big peace out <laughs>what's up world so if you just watched my well, my fourth episode of the 12 strains of christmas and this one's the fifth one then we're still on day eight but they are looking nice and i still wanted to throw a plant progress update on here and it is christmas eve so if you celebrate christmas i hope that you're having a good night and you are having lots of fun with your family or loved ones or whatever i hope that you're all having a good time so we'll take a closer look at these for a quick second and end it off so you can go and open some gifts or some shit so they're doing great and thanks to mars hydro for the lights hopefully you send me a good gift too y'all have a merry christmas ho 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 peace